Get ready for daytime now. I don't know how long it was next day, day after that, that I woke up, you know, I opened my eyes and there was bright lights. Mary Jo woke up and my mother hit the floor, went down on her knees and said, thank you, Jesus. I looked at this nurse and she was yelling at me, Mary Jo, Mary Jo, you've been shot. You're in the hospital, you're gonna be okay. And then I looked at her and it was all fuzzy, like I said, just like in the movies. ABC News' 2020 released a preview of its latest episode, which features new interviews with Mary Jo Buttafuoco and Joey Buttafuoco, almost 30 years after Amy Fisher, Joey's mistress, shot Mary Jo in the head on the front porch of her Long Island home. Fisher's crime shocked the country, and the then 17-year-old became a regular in the tabloids. The story even inspired a TV movie starring Drew Barrymore. But viewers of the episode preview on Twitter had mixed reactions, with some saying they weren't interested in revisiting the scandal. Old news and story, said one. And if you don't believe that trash can't be recycled, you should tune in to ABC's 2020 special on the Buttafuoco's. But others were glad to see the news magazine checking in with the players from a once hot story. I'm glad she's happy and well now, said one of Mary Jo Buttafuoco. And setting my DVR now, said another. Fisher pled guilty to first-degree assault and spent more than six years in prison before being paroled in 1999. Whether viewers are interested in watching the story remains to be seen, but you can't deny that almost 30 years later, the story still gets people buzzing.